Hey everybody, this is Freeplay here, and <laughs> we're continuing back with some Genshin Impact gameplay, but but unfortunately, during this recording, the audio for my voice didn't save. So, uh, for the most part in this playthrough, you're just going to be hearing the game audio, and you're going to be seeing me talk, but not hearing anything. So I just wanted to give everybody a heads up. And with these videos, this will be like the next three or four videos that it's going to be like this. Uh, I'll just be commentating over the videos uh, during portions of the video where, in, you know, there's no story sections going on. But I'll just be adding in my little two cents here and there. So be on the lookout for it. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. We have a lot more videos coming your way, a lot more Genshin Impact. Uh, we have some Blue Protocol information coming up and... And also, Immortal Phoenix Rising, I got a chance to play that demo uh, through Google Stadia. So, so just sit back and enjoy, and we'll go ahead and get started with this video. Let me officially introduce the city of wind, dandelions, and freedom. Travelers under the protection of the Knights of Havonius, welcome to Mondstadt. Finally, no more having to camp outdoors. But the city folk don't look too cheery. Everyone's been put out of place by storm terror recently. But everything will turn out fine as long as Jean's with us. Jean? Acting Grand Master of the Knights of Havonius, Jean, Defender of Mondstadt. With Jean on our side, surely even the vicious Storm Terror will be no match for us. Before I take you guys to the Knights of Havonius headquarters, I have a present for you, Traveler. It's a reward for helping me clear out that Hillitrol camp. H hey! Why doesn't Paimon get a reward? Uh, because this reward is useless to you, Paimon. But I'll treat you to a traditional Mondstadt delicacy, Sticky Honey Roast. Sticky Honey Roast! Come with me. We'll head to the city's, uh, high ground. This used to be a bustling street, but with so many storm terror attacks recently, the usual crowds are nowhere to be seen. Except for the local tavern near the city wall over there. They haven't been affected. If anything, their business is better than ever. Oh, the present I want to give you is a wind glider. Outriders use them to ride the wind, and the people of Mondstadt, I brought you here to give it to you so you can experience it right away. Oh, you're really excited about these wind gliders, huh? Well, that's because the wind is the heart and soul of Mondstadt. Oh. Alrighty then, enough talk. Let's give it a whirl. It's easy to use, but you still need to pay attention to my instructions.
sky. your fall with the power of a thousand winds. Now, concentrate. See yourself grasping the wind. Harness its energy. You've actually got the power to go up against the dragon. Are you a new ally? Or a new storm? Storm Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself! Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right time! We must... Hold on, Amber. Are you perhaps forgetting to introduce us? Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry captain. These two are travelers from afar. From afar? Is that all we know of them? Story short, I see. Welcome to Mondstadt. Uh, though you haven't arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. I understand the anguish of being separated from family. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the Animo God, oh, but everyone has their secrets, right? <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend our thanks to you for your help just now. Ah, uh, how about a traditional Mondstadt delicacy? Sticky honey roast? Your fight to defend the city against the dragon just now was witnessed by no small number of citizens. The acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius is also very interested in meeting you, and formally invites you both to our headquarters.
the Knights of Favonius headquarters. Let's head in. Jean, what's the hurry? I thought we agreed to meet them here. There have been sightings of storm terror outside the city. Once we meet, we must... Relax. I'll lend a hand when the time comes. Jean, I brought them. <sighs> and once it was over, I brought them straight here. Mondstadt welcomes you, Windborn Travelers. I am Jean, acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. This is Lisa, our resident librarian. <laughs> oh, are you sweeties here to help us out? <laughs> You're both so adorable. Sadly, the timing is regrettable. Storm Terror has caused quite a ruckus in the region since its recent resurgence. Simply put, Mondstadt's elemental sphere and ley lines are now akin to a yarn ball in the paws of a kitten. For a mage, it couldn't get much worse. My skin is one elemental particle away from a full-blown breakout. <sighs> if it weren't for this interference, the Knights of Favonius would have better ways to help you than just putting up missing person posters. We simply ask that you repose in Mondstadt while we help you seek out your sister. Too. Good. In that case, we need a plan. With Storm Terror now directly attacking Mondstadt, we may have an opportunity to cut this problem off at the source. Lisa has revealed the sources of Storm Terror's power with her detection magic. Is that so? They're located in the abandoned Four Winds Temples. Storm Terror's ability to whip up these kinds of storms can be attributed to it drawing power from the temples. Our objective is to deal with three of the four temples. I trust everyone understands why we are only dealing with three. Paimon doesn't. Knights of Favonius, time is against us. The storm is rampant. There's no point in maintaining a defensive position. All right, we need to take initiative and act before the situation escalates. Hey everyone, if you're enjoying this video, please be sure to leave a comment, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified and updated on any future videos. And until the next time, stay safe and be blessed.